All right, you're welcome back to the Balanced Diet of Teletainment this morning. Now, if you check your Google this morning, you go see say the next bus stop will just a pesh on top, just like butterfly wants it down on top. Butter, um, now the one with the call waiting the shelly in the news. And this first one, it concerns the Federal Road Safety Corps and the recruitment exercise that been a screening process within the commerce I do. Now, then talk say about 324,000 applicants don't come outside, apply for the vacancy where they don't put on top of their website. Now, the vacancy is just about um, 4,000 vacancies waiting for there. And they say this one, no, they want to start the screening process across 36 states of the Federation. Now, the call marshal, Dr. Oyeyemi, come outside. He visited the two screening centers for the National Stadium um, and the um, Moga, Moga Adishu Barracks were inside Abuja on Monday. And he talks, say, only 4,000 successful applicants, nine they go, nine go they recruited, by the core. Now, in commerce, I talk to you about 400, they go engage them out of the 105,000 universities, um, university graduates, where they partake, where they take part in the ongoing screening exercise. He said this screening exercise will share for four days. Now, according to what the commerce, I talk, the applicants for the officers, um, cadet, according to what in the FRAC board, the commerce, I talk, they said they go screen them Monday and Tuesday while the screening for the other, the other sections or other positions will share them between Thursday and Sunday. In commerce, I talk, say this same tool they talk, it is share all around the whole federation. He said, from waiting with CEO, he said, be like, say, some of some day when are pregnant women, some day when are over age, some day when short, so they don't get to the height, some day when they even meet requirements, some day when they don't marry. So, all this one too, some of them, now things will be like, say, if it to qualify, if it to disqualify them, uh, according to what they talk. He talks, say, pregnant women and nursing mothers in the exercise, he said, they go disqualify them. Over age applicants, they will also not be considered. He said this now some of the things where they go use the screen out or the shifter, the people where they need from the people where they don't need at all at all. Um, that's that, 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 that the number of people don't come out and apply now is over 300,000. 324,000 applicants for just 400 for positions. Just, um, for just 4,000 four. vacancies, according to what they see from the headline here, for 4,000 vacancies, uh, it could be. So they go actually <laughs> engage about 400. 400 will be engaged out of 105,000. Um, university graduates where they actually take part for inside the ongoing screening. Yes, we understand say the level of unemployment will actually increase when inside Wobodo, Nigeria. But I, 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 you need to explain more concerning this statement saying pregnant women and nursing mothers where they for inside the exercise, they go disqualify them, including those where they over aged. At what age person go reach where they go they over age for this particular um, uh, for now, for, for the pregnancy um, and the nursing position. mothers, we'll not say for health reasons, it's better they be exempted. Just like during NYSE, if they go for NYSE exercise, if you're pregnant, um, you, you know, fit, you cannot. Yeah, but what is the screening then process of If you're a nursing mother, you cannot, for, for health reasons, especially for the mother and the child. It cuts for, for, for that one, for pregnant mother and nursing mother, it, it's almost, you know, a lot of um, sectors, if you're trying to get a job, a lot of sectors will consider the fact that your health right now is more important than knowing say you need is to get your, a job. Are you sure, is it your health, really? or that they feel, say, if you're pregnant or if you're a nursing mother, your level of attention and your level of effectiveness will actually reduce. Oh, it's, it's more or less. It's, it's more, more or less. Explain more it, on average, this. on average, it's more or less about your health because for a, for a, for a, for a nursing mother now, you they open to a lot of infections. You they open to, and then you, your, your ability, your agility, in, for example, NYC, your agility as a pregnant woman so you're not is not, function you're, not well. you're not perfectly fit. Because it's going to be a lot of physical exercise. The same thing is applicable to when you're a nursing mother. A lot of physical exercise, a lot of vigorous exercise. I will not say certain training, so certain levels of training they involve in terms of FRSC and the training they go give their people. So they need to be sure that you're 100% sound health-wise. If they not say another person there where they 100, we know we know they be pregnant woman or when they're a nursing mother, you're a woman and you fit in that same position, it's safer. If you ask the average Nigerian, it's safer to pick a person who is not a nursing mother, but she's a woman as well. And so what about those that are woman. married? Because you know why they talk this? I feel when we make some kind of statement, because right now we're so gender sensitive, we need to explain more. Now, talking about pregnant women or nursing, nursing mothers, for explain, say, come, the process is too rigorous for these people, and that is why we don't want them to be to, uh, to actually come into this particular process. But in that case, and it now, should what be about married women? Because he talks, say, sorry, he talks, say, from what we are seeing, there are some pregnant women, there are some who are over age and those who are short and they did not meet the requirements. Some are married. So if you are married, does it mean you cannot actually come for this? Like, like a lot of things, they weigh for this self-explanatory. It, it could be, it could be, say in the case of the married woman, she's probably pregnant. Or in the case of a married woman, she's probably a nursing mother. Right. So there are different classes where they inside right. where um, we might not be privy to.
All right, so we're we'll going to hear the outcome of this and see how far we can go with getting more FRSC officials. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.